ladies and gentlemen it's your buddy Kid Thunder back again with another video for you and today um, I just want to have a thought about this video because I know this is pretty gaming related uh, this is not a review as you can see uh, I am I actually am planning on doing a review sometime soon but the question is are you really too old I mean when when would there be a time when you are too old to play video games now this act this actual question really comes to people who are around my age and older now I'm in my mid 20s as you can see uh, and you know I've always thought of this question because really for people like me you know I have I have a job you know I'm obvious and even then I'm also in between jobs too so there's really not much time for me I mean for gaming anyway the the mass amount of time I usually go for gaming now is like whenever I'm doing a, a video game review and that's pretty much it so I mean other than that I it's really hard you know to do any gaming time whenever I could now I was on the gamecapsule.com which is a site that is produced by uh, AG aka Anthony Gomez um, <clears throat> now, according to the Entertainment Software Rating Board, or ESA, or whatever the he or whatever the heck you call it, um, the average age of a gamer is 30 years old, with with the average age of the most frequent game purchaser pinned at 35. Now. I will post a link to the full ESA status report. Uh, you'll find that on the description. So, here's the thing. Now, on AG Entertainment's uh, the game consoles, I mean the game capsule website, it does state that if you're an older gamer, these statistics may relieve you for a bit but you may find yourself in the same predicament time and time again playing online video games with five-year-olds now for instance like you would now he says this particular quote because if you're playing against five-year-olds online yeah you, you know some people would notice that now I'm not speaking for you know kids who play online and all that good stuff but what I'm really saying is that you'll notice that there are a lot of people online that use a load of expletives while playing games like uh, Call of Duty or or Minecraft or Team Fortress and things like that. So, <clears throat> so, and then we can also see that remember the original Game Boy commercial when the Game Boy first came out it does state that you don't get too old when you play games um, you only get you only get too old when you stop playing I mean however it is pronounced but you know I'll, I'll post a link to that uh, description anyway now put it this way you got Danny Dutch or Danny Douche or however the heck you pronounce his name and all these other women in the Today Show you know they all think that it's weird for people for people that is like over 30 years old to play video games now I don't know about you but uh, like I said in this video I mean I haven't really seen anyone I know who play I mean anyone I know over 30 years old who play video games now I mean 
I really cannot recall that off the top of my head, but I mean, I just know for a fact that people who are my age and people younger than me play video games around tw all the time. So, but now, you know, to to those people who are listed on the Today Show. Yeah, I understand that there's more to life than just video games. I mean, you know, and and if you also look at it in the video game industry, you do have people who are in their 30s that do play video games for a living, for one thing. Say, for instance, like you have uh, quality assurance testers who test out a new video game before they're being released. Now, I'm not... Now, I personally have not been in the video game industry, but needless to say, I do feel that people who are 30, 30 years old and over who have a QA job, I mean, a QA tester position in the video game industry, they pretty much know, I mean, they pretty much do all that just for a living, you know, say for instance, like, they play a game just to see if the graphics are great if there if there is like additional graphics that needed to be added or if there's any particular glitches that needs to be set you know I mean any particular glitches that needs to be fixed or wherever the heck so I mean that's all I really need to say on that so now in conclusion to this video you know whenever you are too old to play video games well in conclusion you know within every particular generation of video of the gaming industry pretty much no matter how old you are you can still play a lot of uh you know play video games that pretty much you know suits your interests I mean here's the thing back in 2006 when the Nintendo Wii was released um pretty much the pretty much that changed that particular mindset that um you know that everyone can at least enjoy a video game system you know you know veteran video game players like myself uh, even elder video gamers um, that never played a video game in their single life or even younger kids who are just now starting to get into video games in the first place so so pretty much that was that main market now you know do I really say that the Wii U would go into that particular stage well time will tell on that and I mean and I'll, all I do have to say is that the Wii U is pretty much an interesting console so but I'm not going to get too much into it because I'm getting a little off topic right here and I really want to say that this is really the entire video I want to discuss upon you know in regards to the question you know what age are you too old to play video games I mean every generation of video gaming pretty much has its um, target audience anyway I mean put it put it this way now you know a lot of, a lot of gamers call themselves say saying that um, Nintendo is pretty much geared to like little kids and you know if you have a Xbox or a PlayStation then you're a grown man and you and whatever you know but generally it's not necessarily the case anyway so 
I mean, 1985, yeah, we had the NES. And come this holiday season of 2012, you know, the Wii U will be released. So, that's really, so, it's really nothing, you know, it's really self-explanatory to the, now, you might ask this question, do I enjoy other things in life besides video games? Now, if you have seen my YouTube stuff, uh, I mean, you do see that I do make a lot of music for a living. You know, I am a chiptune artist. Um, and then, you know, you see a lot, you know, there are a few times where I've done some rants in on YouTube as well. And not to mention, um, you can also see that I'm doing a video blog. I'm doing video blogging which I am working on this particular video blog right here um, what else you know um, and then you know I enjoy other stuff like I like drawing and I also like you know writing and you know you know and I do other stuff like, you know, say for instance, like there will be times where I go to the forest preserve and enjoy nature and things like that. I've done a video blog about that last year. Uh, so, so leave your thoughts and comments. You can send me a video response or you can private message me on this particular subject are you too old to play video games uh, and then I will also have the full article link in the description so you can check it out and you can also check out the today show clip where you know on the same article where you know AG was talking about on the gamecapsule.com uh, as of now, this is Kit Thunder signing off. Take care, everyone. Stay tuned for future content. I'll have a review in about three weeks.